So, when will you be coming back to New York, Carrie? Oh, I don't know. Hi, guys. Is everything okay? Yes, it's delicious. Thank you. That's great. Oh, New York waiters never leave you alone. I really don't like all this, hi guys, is everything okay, stuff. What, you mean waiters aren't friendly in London? Oh, they're very friendly. Yes, they're friendly, but not too friendly. They don't bother you all the time. Can I get you anything else? More drinks, maybe? No, thanks, we're fine. Fantastic. See what I mean? Personally, I think people in London are a lot more easygoing. London's just not as hectic as New York. I'm sure. We all like peace and quiet. But in my opinion, New York is possibly, well, no. It's definitely the greatest city in the world. Don't you agree? <laughs> to be honest, I definitely prefer London. Well, come on, Rob. You've lived in both. What do you think? Oh, uh, well, I have to say, London's very special. It's more relaxed. It's got great parks and, and you can cycle everywhere. It's dangerous to cycle in New York. Why would you cycle when you can drive a car? <laughs> you can't be serious. Okay, I agree. London has its own peculiar charm. But if you ask me, nothing compares with a city like New York. The whole world is here. But that's the problem. It's too big. There are too many people. Everybody's so stressed out and nobody has any time for you. I don't think that's right, Carrie. Uh, New Yorkers are very friendly. Oh, sure, they can sound friendly with all that have a nice day stuff, but I always think it's a little bit fake. <laughs> You've gotta be kidding me. Oh, I'm sorry, I'll just have to take this. Yes. You're who? The taxi driver. What did she leave? The cell phone. Right, okay. Um, yes, we're, we're still at the restaurant. Uh, see you in about five minutes.